Allison, and I'm with the ISPCP, which is the Internet Service Providers and Connectivity Providers. We are part of the Commercial Stakeholders Group, which is the ISPCP, the BC, and the IPC. We make up the non-contracted party business constituency uh, within ICANN. And the ISPCP has a unique role within that dynamic of three groups in that we are the people that build the infrastructure of the internet uh, from a non-contractor perspective. If you are one of the companies that makes up the nuts and bolts of the internet, if you pro provide services to end users and you're not a contracted party to ICANN, you still need your voice to be heard. We do a lot of relevant work here that makes a difference in the whole grand scheme of things that affects your business. We're still in the very early stages of the internet. The internet is changing tremendously every day. And this is the arena in which we get to decide how the internet grows, because it will. And if the people that are building the internet don't have a stake in its further expansion, there's a problem. So if you are an internet service provider, if you are a connectivity provider, you need to be engaged with us because the stuff that we're doing is very relevant to your business and your bottom line and the needs of your customers. I've only been around for about a year and a half. And it really seems like a different language when you're coming into it. There are so many acronyms and you're just swimming in all these different issues and you really don't know what's going on at the beginning. My strong recommendation is that you find a constituency and you join it. The big picture issues are often really difficult to grasp onto until you start putting them through a lens of a constituency and you start looking at the issues through their perspectives. That's when it started to click for me. Not in the big GNSO meetings, not in the board meetings, but within the ISPCP. So my big recommendation is go straight for joining a constituency and you'll start to get your bearings quicker. ICANN can be incredibly intimidating. And what's interesting is you show up at these meetings and you see these people and they're going off on these big soliloquies about these things that at first you don't really have any clue about. And you think to yourself, I. I I'm not going to be able to engage like that. But you stick around and you, day by day, learn a little bit more about what's going on and you get to a point where you say, I've got a tremendous amount to contribute. Um, the things that they're talking about, not only do I understand them, but I've got a unique perspective on what's going on. So, uh, you know, if you are a newcomer, w what I can tell you is, I was a newcomer not too long ago and I'm contributing uh, on par with any of the people that you're seeing up at the microphone when you go to your first meeting. It's only a year and a half in for me, so you can do it quickly too.